All right, so we're ready to play ball. This is kind of what, what you hope for as you get to that uh, end of the season and the games count. Every game counts, but this is a big one. Uh, Hudson will go to Eau Claire North on Thursday as well. So uh, whichever team wins tonight for sure has a share of the Big Rivers Conference, Big Rivers title. And depending on how the outcome goes, if one team can sweep, then they're the outright winners this year. So that's kind of where you want to be at the end of the year, yeah. something that counts. So a uh, little bit about North. I know we talked about them earlier in the season covering other games, but they are a perennial uh, kind of top of the conference team. Sure, They're sure. well coached. Uh, just, you know, the North is always a really big school there in Eau Claire that's, that's been – for years, I can remember being good at all sports. Well, now they've kind of fine-tuned things. You know, football struggled. Basketball's been pretty good. But baseball's always been a consistent that's, form. That's always been deal. excellent. So. Nice. So we got leading off catcher Jonah Hansen. Popped up. Down that uh, left side. Just in front of the crowd. The crowd, <laughs> it's funny. You watch the shade and the crowd, literally, it's like. Boop, 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 yeah, boop. how many people can you get under three trees? Everybody's that's kind of the question. in the shade. There's nobody in the sun. <laughs> right. That's great. Hudson's got their ace on the mound again, Owen Anderson. This is those emotional games Owen yeah. likes to, yeah. to likes to compete in. Ran into Owen downstairs uh, probably 30 minutes before game time here, and he was grabbing an ice cube out of the uh, the freezer and just kind of rubbing it around on the head <laughs> yeah. and the neck. And he's hot. I mean, all these yeah. guys are hot out there. It's it's a battle <laughs> with the heat a little bit. Not only Eau Claire North, but the heat as well. Yeah, absolutely. But both teams are feeling it the same, so see which That's team right. can kind of battle through it. That's a fly ball. Looks like it's going to go foul. Left fielder taking a chase, bouncing out there. Oh, just misses that oh. catch. <laughs> Laid out for that excellent effort that time. Thought he had that, too. It looks like it. Troy Boning out there. Lots of speed. Mm-hmm. Yeah, he definitely is a speedster out there. Just couldn't secure it, so. New life. Hanson was booking. He was already at second base, say. but that was fall by, yeah. I'd say, about a good 10 feet. Yeah. Two and two. He's taking a run out there. Getting, mm -hmm. <laughs> getting his legs beneath him here with this heat. Let's see if Anderson goes with the curveball here. Nope. Going heat. Straight heat down the middle. So three and two, a full count coming up for the uh, first batter for Eau Claire. It's number 15, Jonah Hansen. I keep your phone in the shade over yeah, here for thank you. you so it doesn't overheat. Full count, Anderson with the delivery and the pitch. Oh, nice curveball that time. time. Owen Anderson, it's his first guy swinging. Nice work by Owen. Working through the pitch count there. What was that Short last stop, pitch? Evan Seco. Oh, that was a curveball. Curveball? Yeah, okay. he got that thing to bend. Just come inside on the left-handed batter. Woo! Got that inside corner fastball that time. Fun to watch. Going well, heading to St. Cloud next year. Going to play ball for them. Ooh, just a little high. <laughs> Almost got him chase. Okay. I'm liking this ump already. He's got some good, uh, got a vo good voice to him. You, know, mm -hmm. you can hear him. Some of these guys get a little quiet. It's not as uh, animated in their call. Curveball that time. He's got the corner. <laughs> that a boy. A one up, one and two. Oh, nice curveball that time. Up the middle. Walter makes the play, sets and throws. Nice job. Gets him by a couple steps. Nice play, just getting his feet set that time, being able to turn, pivot, make the throw. Excellent job there by Walter. Again, I'd like to say thank you to Brian Mose, who is on our camera. I saw him down there, poor Brian, right sweating now, it out is, down there. He's sweating to the oldies, we like to say. I gave him an umbrella, but he, uh, he just straight Oh, nice curveball that time in for a strike. Getting it out down there. Up to the plate for the Huskies, number 30, Gabe Richardson. Ooh, just a little Ooh. inside that time. Heat coming there. The Eau Claire North giving him a good bark from the bench there. I hear that. <laughs> like the dog pound, old school. Yeah. 
I'll just, uh, I know we've, outside on that one, we've run two cameras in the past. I had my, had my camera behind home plate and the heat just was not doing, was not really working so well on it. So we're running one camera tonight. All right. Our, I get our, it. Uh, well, the North, the North, operated North right bus blew a tire on the way here. Nice curveball. That's it. Oh, just dip a little low. Boy, close. Right over the plate, but just dropped a little bit below the knees that time. Three and one. Yeah, when the heat gets going, everything, you know, you can see cars <laughs> overheating, <laughs> abandoned yeah. on the road and everything else. Curveball gets away from one that time. Draws a two-out walk. A little high on that one. He'll get a farmer's blow done, clear up the sinuses real quick. <laughs> Missed that part. Work a little bit of the chicken <laughs> neck out of things and get ready to roll again. Oh, yeah. We'll call it out. If you're if, if it's in the field of play, it's uh, it's fair game. All right. All right. Fair <laughs> enough. I love Owen. He knows that. <laughs> Number 19, left fielder Cole Bacham up to the plate. Owen's getting a little sweaty out there, I think, requesting a towel from the dugout. Sometimes you'll see him have a rosin bag out there. You ever see that? Pictures yeah, of the rosin sure bag. That's for hand sweats, too. Get that off the hand. Well, maybe he oh, wouldn't do it for himself. Well, maybe he's got a bloody nose or something. I don't know. Looks like the you. dugout's cheering for the trainer. Are they? Nice. Yeah, make it, they're into it tonight. Everybody gets a cheer. Well, that's a good look, Owen. Yeah, just put a little, a little, little uh, uh, toilet paper up one nostril. Yep. Fire one up the other one and call it a day. There you go. Looks like a bull out there. <laughs> it does. <laughs> Humany Christmas. I love it. <laughs> Hope player coach keeping an eye on things. So like I'm, I'm thinking he probably got a little blood on his hand, too. Yeah. Yep, he farmer bull just a uh, little little Loosen too much that time. Up, baby, yeah. Yep. Well, <laughs> we got a raging bull on the mound now, yep. baby. Two outs. Man on first. Richardson on just threw the walk. Yep. Bock him at the plate. Ooh. Just missed that. Fastball inside tailed there. off inside that time. It's crazy. We're at the uh, last week, three go season. Yep. Playoffs coming up yep. next week. Yeah, tomorrow's the seating meeting, so I, I'll mention oh, that here yeah, in a second, yeah. too. So that's an important uh, important night, and this is an important game for that because whichever team ends up uh, winning this game is going to go into that seating meeting with at least knowing that they're conference champs. Yeah. So it's probably going to mean a higher seed as well. Okay. Fouled off, right side, left, right side, my bad. Kyler hold behind the plate. Keeping an eye on that runner at first, just not a big lead yet, but I would expect Eau Claire probably be, to be pretty aggressive on the base pass today. One and two. One gives a look over there. Nice pitch. Oh, Curveball, oh, strike three. Oh. Owen's fired up. Boom. Don't, don't blow any more uh, blood out of your nose, Owen. We need you in there. <laughs> don't blow any more gaskets, my man. Good inning for Owen Anderson and the Raiders. No runs, no hits. One man left after one half inning. Eau Claire North zero. Hudson coming to bat. Welcome Ooh. back to Raider Field here. Getting ready for the bottom of the first. Zero, zero. Pitching for Eau Claire North, junior Andrew Milner. Just watching him here, lefty's got a good curveball. Kind of a long extended delivery if you watch him, if you see him on the camera. Yeah. But that bender definitely uh, has some movement to it. So a nice throw down to second there from the catcher. Second baseman Gabe Walter, senior, up to lead off for the Raiders. Walter with a nice play in that uh, opening inning to catch one of the outs. I saw him at a grad party on Saturday night after that 20 to 19 game, and yeah. he said, "He goes, uh, they got two runners on base at the end. Um, Wasa did, and I think he turned a double play, and he was like, I was so worried, I just wanted to get out of there.'" <laughs> <laughs> I love it. Got Fly ball this time. Looks like it's Straight just up. out the infield. Second baseman plants underneath it. Oh, center fielder calls him off, makes the catch. One out. 
A lot of confusion almost, it looked like. Both yeah. those guys were getting pretty close to each other, and then second baseman peeled off the last minute. Fun, fun work in the senior party again with John Walter. Mm-hmm. Yeah. Johnny Roulette. Is that Johnny the Roulette. Yeah. Yeah. Johnny Roulette. Your roulette dealer tonight's Johnny Roulette. <laughs> Jake busting up to the plate now. Short stop for the Raiders. Strike one. Both these teams seem to have some pretty good pitchers. Yeah, like I mentioned, we were off the air, but on the roster, Oakland North shows eight kids as listed as pitchers. Now, obviously, those could be secondary positions, but we'll see. They might uh, We'll see how Milner does here, but it looks like they've got plenty of depth to be able to throw a few arms tonight. Yeah. 0-2 on Bussin. Curveball again, oh, ground ball one. down to third base, sets his feet, makes the throw just in time to get Bussin. Nice play off a third there, a little bouncer. Sometimes it'll, we saw a week or so ago, the speed can change just a bit from hitting that grass, but I think it's pretty dry out there, unlike the other, other day yeah, when it was sure. wet and it kind of <laughs> slowed, slowed things down quite a bit. So Yep, for sure. Pitcher Owen Anderson up to the plate, two outs, bottom of one for Hudson. Raging Bull, ready to go. Yep. Fastball inside. I don't know. Two outs. Curveball. Short of the plate that time. Well, good eye. Two and oh. I wish I would have brought another shirt, man. I know. Like starting to maybe drip a through flannel this one. or something? Yeah. yeah. Oh, another shirt so you're sweaty. Oh, <laughs> yeah. I didn't know you were getting hot over there. Yeah. Sheesh. I'm like ready to put a jacket on. I'm so cold right now. <laughs> <laughs> My gosh. We had a track meet yesterday. I saw a guy with a hoodie pulled up over his head. Long Fall back. Long sleeve hoodie, too. Mm. Like... That's the kind of stuff. That's, that's what How wrestlers doing, wear in this right. kind of heat. They need to draw, shed weight, so... How are you doing that? Yeah, just hot. Yeah, those poor track guys yesterday. My son, my uh, youngest, Will, runs. Uh, not runs. He's a jumper. And, uh, wow. I can't imagine. I just hot. Mm-hmm. Those guys and gals that are running around that track. It's, you know, dark blue. Yeah. <laughs> Having fun? <laughs> Two and one. Ooh. Fall again. Ooh. Just pull this head a little bit that time. Oh, took that one, I think. Evens the count, two and two on Anderson. Did he break the uh, the ump's like chin protector there? Yeah, I don't think so. But you'll see that a lot of times when the umpire gets dinged. Catcher, it's kind of catcher etiquette. We've talked about baseball and sure. all that. Sure. Go out and give Blue a little chance to recover. And you, you know, in this heat, you take a a little teeth shatter or ch teeth chattering shot off mm -hmm. of the helmet. Doesn't feel so good. A wake up call. He's telling the catcher, next time, can you get your hands on that thing? <laughs> yeah. You gotta be a little quicker for me. All right, two and two, two outs. Oh, we're battling through it right now. Shaking off the sign there. Milner might be looking for a curveball. Oh, and says, ah, give me a second. <laughs> I like that. Everybody regroup here. Front foot dug in. 2-2 two, two delivery. Got one down a second. Little hopper. There you go. Quick inning there. 1-2-3 yeah. for Hudson. No runs, no hits. Nobody left after one. Eau Claire North 0, Hudson 0. Well, welcome back to Raider Field. Again, Ken Conan and Aaron Sundin in the booth. Brian Moe is on our camera tonight. We've got uh, him until about 6.30, and then we have a backup coming in. Well, I don't know if I can be calling her a backup. Well, uh, first team All-American, but she's backing up on camera tonight. It's my my bride. She's uh, she's nervous as I'll get out, too. She's like, you know I'm not that great. I'm like, I need somebody, okay? You can do it. Soccer. Brian's going to soccer. I mean, my other cameraman's, I don't know. 
MIA traveling Europe or something. <laughs> These cameramen, I tell you, they're just anything goes. All right, top of the second here. North. First baseman Sam Feck up to the plate, number five batter. Ooh, Ooh just inside, almost my. got him in the toesies. Quick there. Well, got away from him just a little bit. One and oh. Fastball that time, fly ball. Popped up. Left field, boning. Sets up underneath it, makes the catch. He made about eight steps there. He saw it the whole way. Nice job of bounding. Just. I don't know. I'm still like amazed sometimes. You know these pop ups and just they judge them almost instantaneously. You yeah. Know, where it's just like wow. Awesome. Yeah. Well, it helps if you see it off the bat. Yep. And obviously yeah, there's not a lot of sure. wind tonight either, so that sure. that's helpful. And he's got a good spot there at the sun at his back. You, Right, curveball that time right down the pipe. Chad Crone, the batter for Eau Claire North, second baseman. You get a pop-up out the right field, and it gets a little trickier with that mm -hmm. sun, especially the later we get in the game here. A lot of barking going on in the north dugout over there. I know. It's like the uh, old-school uh, Cleveland dog pound over <laughs> yeah. there. You know, if they yeah. got the masks and everything. <laughs> yeah. That Cleveland dog pound, that's that's a frightening group of uh Yeah, group fan of fans. base curveball yeah. that time gets him again. Frightening. That one looked like he just kind of dropped the floor on it. Crone swung right over the top. One and two. Some nasty stuff on these pitches. See if he comes back with a fastball. This curveball again. Love it. Crone gets a piece of it. Battle in here, yep. One and two still. One out. Bringing, ooh, inside heat that time. <laughs> oh, they're looking for a strike. Down they were looking. Well, he, he he had to turn to get out of the way. And yeah, he actually, yeah. his bat motion forward didn't break the plane though. Two and two. Let's see if he comes back with a fastball here. Jams him that time. Hove making the run for it. Nice catch, Kyler Hove. Wow. Diving play did a great job getting rid of the mask. Got underneath it, stretched out to make that play. Great job, Kyler. His what? dad's in the booth with us tonight, too, so. Just got there an we ESPN go. On yep, that ESPN. One. That was, that we just played awesome. the ESPN highlight for that one. That was a absolute beauty of a catch. Had to hustle on that one all the way. All right. Two down. Nice pitch. Owen doing a good job mixing up. Not only fastballs are on the plate, but that curveball, doing a nice job of, uh, Hudson's doing a nice job mixing their pitches, keeping the hitters off balance. Fly ball, that pop up this time. Looks like it's going to get out to the outfield. Midby has to make a little bit of a run there to get it. There Makes the catch. Really One, two, Midby. three for Owen Anderson that inning. No runs, no hits, nobody left. After one and a half, Hudson zero, Oakland we'll North zero. Owen Wedge, home run hitter this weekend, two in one inning. Really? Not very often you're going to be able to tell uh, your kids and grandkids about that. Wow, that is, uh, that's awesome. I believe that was a 13 run inning. How many runs did they have there, Kenton, the, when they had that big inning? 13 <laughs> runs in one inning. This is the 20 to 19 <laughs> game, I'm yeah. guessing? Yeah. Oh, my goodness. Oh, my First pitch curve ball for a strike. Ball one. Lefty on lefty here. These are the kind of at bats. You, a lot of times you'll see a batter go opposite field at this just because, uh, well, it's just physics. It's Got just him on the corner that time. Fat curve ball. Just how it works. Yeah. <laughs> Hit it where they ain't. Doesn't matter what field. That's right. One and two. Working that curveball. Came in about eye level on that one. Yep. Owen's pants are clean. 
They are. Of course, it is just the second inning. So. I know. It's the first at bat. Yep. So. <laughs> give, it, give it time. Give it time. <laughs> Curveball that time. Ground ball to the shortstop. One hops it. Sets up. Throwing the hey, dirt. Safe. He's safe. <laughs> As he runs across first base, he tells he did the help. Just trying I'm to help safe. him. Yeah, dude, I'm hand. safe. <laughs> Got a boy. Yeah, that ball kind of died off the bat. Shortstop didn't make a play to charge it. Waited for it. One hop. And then just uh, threw the ball a little short. Wedge was able to beat it out. Brings up Logan Von Berg, the DH tonight. Fastball inside. Got that inside edge there. Wedge not a big threat to steal here, but we'll see. Left lefties have a lot easier time being able to throw to first base there, keep that runner honest. Jams him that time mm. for strike two. Yep, tough to get away with too much over there on first base in the uh, pitcher's looking, looking right, right at, at him, right at him. <laughs> yep. Less than up. Outside on Off that speed one. pitch that time outside. Well, I'd like to say a quick hello and a shout out to Bobo Brose. Oh. Bobo hit me up with a quick text. Said, you guys doing this broadcast? Oh, yeah. Yeah, we're here sweating, so uh, Bobo. Sweat. Just thinking about you. Yeah, I'm sure he's down in his basement with a cold glass something. or something. Yep. <laughs> <laughs> well, that one in the dirt. Wedge gets a little bit of a lead on it, but decides to go back. Two and two. We are going to have to throw these headsets in like some I'm sort of you. acid bath, yeah. aren't we? It's just <laughs> disgusting <laughs> right now. Oh, my gosh. Two and two, no outs. Inside. Oh boy, Ooh, tough one. Caught him. Inside fastball that time. Mm. He thought that was a little more inside than it was. So nope. Strike three. Yeah, Milner took his time. He looked over at Wedge two, three times. Mm -hmm. Kind of slowly uh, decided he was going to come to the plate. Gets Von Berg for the first out, strikeout. Brings up Matt Midby, center fielder. He'll be with the final out out there just a second ago. Maybe one of our seniors on the team as well. Yep. So they didn't have info. I know Matt's going to Iowa State next year. He's not going to be a NASA engineer. Well, I, I think after I after after Kenton said that, I could see him kind of the, the wheels turning. Like <laughs> right? maybe I will do that instead. Yeah. So where is he going? Iowa State. Iowa we were State. talking about That's Iowa right. State. The other day uh, we were talking about the other, that. That's the right. other day. Iowa State. Popular Cyclone, place. Right. Yeah. Yep. 2 0. Good spot. Gonna be a smart kid to get in. Wedge is going. Oh, catcher bowls it. Wedge is in clean. Oh, those pants are dirty now. Here Mom, we here we go. That right way, Wedge. That right pant leg all soiled up. Real nice. He, needs to, go, he needs to go to the mound and wipe Owen Anderson's nose, too. Get a little <laughs> blood on there. Be good to go. Just get everything on it. Love it. <laughs> Climb the fence, tear it a little bit. I mean, let's go. 2 and 1. That was that was, uh, that was a steal even before that ball got in the dirt too. So again, I thought Coach Blagan might come out and be a little aggressive tonight. Yeah. Gets a runner in scoring position with one out here, three and one on mid midby. Second baseman. Oh, Crown maybe. ball shortstop. Runner holds. Throw to first again. Another one in the dirt. <laughs> got Good him. scoop that time by first base. Keeps a wedge at second with two outs. Brings up catcher Kyler Hove with that spectacular catch behind the plate last inning. All world. See what uh, Hudson wants to do here with that runner at two. Just kind of watching them try to cover that base. They're a little slow getting over there. Nice hit that time. Oh, Five six. Go. Oh, they're going to send them. Here we Coming go. around. Wedge is going to come in and he's going to play at the plate. Oh, off oh, his yeah. leg. Woo. Ball bounces away. Hove is going to make it to second base. Standing up. RBI for Kyler Hove. Love it. Oh, that was great. Awesome. Great work. 
Looks like we're going to have a pinch runner here for Kyler. Number not, two. Not a, not a courtesy? Yeah, <laughs> courtesy runner. Yeah, oh, Wiley no, Balmer going into the runner. game. <laughs> <laughs> nice two-out single that time by, yeah, it was. We, by uh, Hove oh. to drive home Wedge. Brings us up to the number nine batter for Hudson. Love the call at, uh, as he was coming towards third. Brendan was, Ducharme. Coach wasn't thinking too much. He was like, let's go. Nope, we're, let's go. And it would have been it would have been close. Uh-huh. I think he you know, depending on the slide, he I think he was gonna score, but the throw was kind of right on the mark. Good lead that time. Throw back to second. Gets bomber back to the bag. Bomber well, back to the bag. Let's say that five Tongue times. Tongue twister. A lot of chatter out of the Hudson bench after that run came in. They're, uh, they're pretty pumped up about that. Chirping the uh, the team out there right now. Second baseman keeps peeking in. Bomber's getting a pretty good lead there. Mm-hmm. Keeping the pitcher off balance a little bit. One and one. Bomber's got to be one of the speedsters, right? You don't, you, they don't send a slowpoke in there. Not normally, no. Yeah. <laughs> Getting a good secondary lead. Second base is off the bag. Ooh. Strike two. Good cut. They don't call me Master of the Obvious for nothing over here. <laughs> <laughs> master of the Obvious, knower of nothing. Yeah. Yes. We're going to put the one-legged kid in to go run. Yes. Ooh, nice curveball that time, just outside. Throw down to second. Not in time. Bomber again, being active on the base paths. I like it. Two and two. Correction, I had uh, Ducharme in the number nine spot. He's actually batting number eight. Thank you. Playing third base tonight. He's just driving him nuts on second. Oh, boy, the curveball. Just a little high. (laughs) Yeah, he is. (laughs) It's kind of like that mosquito that you want to keep buzzing in your ear. You just want to swat it. That biting fly that's just like (laughs) bit you twice already. Yep. Dang it. Full count here. Runners going. They're going to throw down to third base. Off off his mitt. In the dirt. Aggressive there that time by Coach Blagan. Ducharme draws (laughs) the walk. That's going to bring up. Number right. in the nine spot, Sam Erickson came in this inning for uh, Tim Hasapopoulos. So runners at first and second, two outs. Erickson normally in the leadoff spot for Hudson. He's going to be uh, here with runners on base, one in scoring position. Like two that. away. I like that. Let's go. See how aggressive Hudson wants to be on the bases here. I would guess with that runner at third base, I wouldn't expect they're going to steal Ducharme, but no. can have been wrong before. And I What? Yeah, no, once or twice. This year? Come on. This few minutes I have been. Fouled off right side. <laughs> <laughs> Trying to help you out, Aaron, but I guess you don't want it. That's right, you have been wrong in the last couple minutes. I, have. I wasn't going to point it I out, have. but you're right. It's, one, it's the heat. Outs. It it's is the, the heat. heat. It's getting to us. We'll readjust this fan in a second. Curveball that time. Wow, Just a little pitch. high. Woo. Just missed a little high. Two and one, two outs. And on first and third on the corners. Again. All this with two outs here. Hudson with one in already. Two on base. Three and one on the batter, Erickson. Gabe Walter on deck. Inside that, oh boy, that one looked like that was a little tight, but yeah. must have crossed the plate there. Full Takes count. the count full. Ducharme will be on his wheels. Moving on the pitch. Runner goes. Woo! Got that Ball one. hit well. Left fielder going back. He doesn't really have a good beat on it. Wow. That one's out of here. Big time Woo! hit for Eric.
Erickson. Erickson with a The homer. freshman with the three-run dinger. That one just popped off the bat. You could see the left fielder tracking it back there, and all of a sudden he ran out of room. Erickson's fired up. Big, big Bench is fired up. Hit there. Boom, just like that. Boom goes the dynamite. That's right. A big, big hit over the left fielder out of play. Wow. Opens the game that right up a, here. Uh, Four nothing <laughs> Hudson. <laughs> All with two wow. outs here. The bottom of the second brings us back to the top of the order. Second baseman Gabe Walter up to the plate. What a great time to knock one out of the park. Two ducks on the pond. Score three. Huge play. It's the first time home run I've seen at this field. I know, yeah. That I know I've Erickson seen. said at least. He had one or two this two. year already? Okay. He's got two so far. Three. Three on the year, Kenton? I thought I thought I had heard he had one at Memorial, too. No? Okay. Pretty sweet. Fresh anyway. Taking it yeah. out of the yard here. Yeah. Well, he, we've talked about him before. He's just oh, yeah. a really good-looking player. And yeah. Fast. You get him on yep. the bases, he can, he can definitely uh, steal bases and Obviously, he's got a little pop. Very good outfielder as well. 1-0 on Walter. Jams him that time. That one's hit pretty well. Left fielder back underneath it. Makes the catch to end the inning. But a big inning for wow. Hudson. Four runs on three hits. Capped off with the home run by Sam Erickson. After two, Hudson four. Eau Claire North zero. All right. Welcome back to Hudson Field here. Ken Conan, Aaron Sundin. Now betting for the Huskies in the number eight position. Let me get my innings straight here. Sorry about that. I have Klein. The third, there we go. What we got for a number on this young number man? 13, number 13, sir. 13. 13. Yeah, I th that's probably right. Jack Klein, number 13. He's not in your roster, but I've got him playing the DH tonight. Jack Klein, all right. So we'll lead off in the top of the third here for Eau Claire North. Again, exciting uh, end of the inning that time for Hudson. Big lead here in this game, big conference game, to determine probably who is going to be the number one seed in the region and also uh, have a leg up for a conference championship. 2-0. Fouled off. Ooh, that one was coming right down Carmichael Road there. Nice pitch. 2-1. Have you been avail um, able to avoid the the fall balls with with the uh, Raider streaming mobile this oh, year? There's the jinx. I <laughs> knew it was coming out of your mouth tonight. <laughs> Final boys game here at home. <laughs> yep, where's the wood? Somebody knock for me in Sundin. Two and two. So far, so Just good. Just misses with the fastball. Or if I did get hit, somebody's pulling all the dents out for I, me. So I bless their heart. I'm going to tell you where you're parking in softball. You are a little. You're a little bit in the danger zone. I don't worry about this because you got this building sure. protecting you. But that's danger just that's zone just for the, that's, baseball when I park there. Well, or either, softball. either, really, yeah, ground ball, Walter, nice play. second base makes the play over to one. Boom, bada bing, it's one out. So that's just a friend giving you a, a nice, a friendly zone. heads well, up. Thank you, friend. Yeah. I appreciate that. So you might want to maybe I'm move gonna, it up on the top. And I'm going to rethink that then. I realize it's going to be a little bit more walking for you to have to get your equipment or to go get your car. But I wonder if they could get me like a golf cart. And well, I can there run you stuff go. around with a golf cart, act a little more official. Yeah, uh, that'd be pretty sweet. <laughs> Number 14, Roscoe Rennock up to the plate now. Right fielder. You know, Moen's got that four-wheeler thing he runs around with sometimes. Yeah? Right? See, right. I get the keys to that deal. Oh, yeah, I'll take some hydration fluids up here. Yeah, thank you. Appreciate it. Angie Wedge. Angie Wedge. Dug dugout club champion of Hudson. Best She's going to help us out with some water here. Thank you, Angie. Thank you, Angie. We won't pass out. One and yet. one. Oh, just misses that time. Anderson wanted that call. I'll tell you, every time that I'm here setting up, Angie's downstairs. Back in the coolers, getting things prepped for the uh, for the games, and um, big thank you to her for doing that for the dug for the team, the, the dugout club. I mean, that's a that's a big deal. She's so awesome. Thank you, thank you, thank you. Tough to get folks to to help sometimes, and 
It's it's great. Yeah, <laughs> understatement of the year, right? <laughs> it seems like the older I get, the, the less people want to volunteer. Oh, like, no, oh. I drive that time, bounding over there, chases it, gets it down. That's holds him to a single. That was pretty that well single, hit. Yeah. Yeah, it seems like the younger parents maybe aren't as into the. <laughs> yeah, listen helper, up, right? people. You guys need to step up, folks. <laughs> You know, well, it's, you know it's hard. It takes it, it, it takes a lot of uh, it takes a lot of people to do some of the things that happen. I, and I think we've talked about this before. Thank you, Angie. Thank you, Angie. Appreciate Brings it. Brings us back to the top of the lineup. Number, I'm sorry, the catcher Jonah Wilson. Ooh, just a little Jonah low Hansen. on that one. Yeah, it's sometimes it's intimidating to get in because you think, oh, I don't know if I'm gonna have the time. But right, you usually right. have the time, and a lot of parents if they're at the game yep. certainly um, have the ability to help but I'm off my soapbox let's get back to baseball here Yeah. pretty decent lead down there Ooh, Hove makes the throw down nice throw Hove just, just missed yeah I always felt Redick like is, um, when I was a parent a younger you parent still? Oh, when okay. I was a younger parent yep. <laughs> always got to clarify with you a younger parent I was like I'm going to be at these things anyway yeah Right, jump in a coaching deal or jump in a volunteer, whatever. Yeah, when I was one and one, back in a former life. That's right. I feel like with a graduate now, I'm. Uh, we still got one. I got one. We still left got one at home. One left in the. So I expect you to be doing every, you know, be at group. all the games and yep. be uh, selling popcorn and. No, yep. he's kind of a track star, so. All right. You know. <laughs> well, just saying. <laughs> Um, Renick over there is getting a little yes, bit aggressive is. on his lead. Decent secondary. That that's going to keep happening. Hove's keeping an eye he's, on him down there. He's like, I'll keep firing down there at you, homie. I got you covered. Well, Hanson all of a sudden gets the count here, three and one, after the one-out single by Renick. Again, Hudson leading four to zero here, top three. A lot of action going on from the catcher to first base this uh, at bat. Outside that time. So two on here. One out. Brings us up to the shortstop, Evan Zakow. Next up to bat, number six, Evan Zakow. Evan Zakow. That's a great name. Again, it's hot out there. We talked about Owen. He's an aggressive kid. He's a competitor. Might just be time to... Maybe just start trying to get that rhythm. Mm -hmm. Curveball was working real well there in the first couple innings. Seen a lot of fastballs so far here in the so far in the third inning. Steps off that time. Hove's going to go down and have Come a on. chat with him. Have a quick talk. So one out here. Top of the third. Wedge is up, not covering the runner at first base. Maybe worrying about a bunt there. Now he's back. Let's see if we see the corners creep up a little bit. Might have seen something from mm -hmm. uh, the film or scouting. Now he's back. Not really holding the runner, though. One and one. A bit high there. Not worried about the, about the runners right now. Ooh, that was a good-looking pitch. Just a little low that time. That, that's been a strike all night when it's been uh, about waist level. That one was just a little low. Two and one. Ooh. Owen now just trying to get his composure. Mm -hmm. Three and one. Takes a little walk off the mound there. Regroup with the region bowl back. There it is. Heat. Oh, yeah, I got him. Full count. Batter looks down to the third base line for a quick signal and steps back into the box here. Mm 
Curveball runner. Oh, well, they were sending the runners that time, too. I think uh, Coach was kind of realizing that nobody was covering second base. He was getting a very good lead over there. Mm -hmm. Just decided to take off, but it didn't matter. Owen Anderson with a five-pitch walk. So base is juiced here. Ooh. Brings us up to the number three batter, Gabe Richardson. He's a big guy, too. Look at this guy. He looks like a, a linebacker. Jams him that time with the fastball. Fouled off, strike one. <laughs> Are you see. feeling the same thing I am? Yeah, Starting like, to get like I'm sticking to my seat. Bit. Yeah, stand up, air out real quick. Yeah, North threatening here. Top of three. Ooh, curveball oh. gets away. Oh. 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 does a nice job yeah. tracking that one down. Anything pass ball here, unless you get a really good bounce, is probably going to score a run, advance the runners. So. Important job back there for the catcher to yep. stay in front of everything. Woo! Fastball, Got strike away. two. Good pitch. And one out right now. One and two is the count. Ground ball, second base. That's going to score a run. See if they can turn two. Throw over to first. Got him. Got him in time. Wow. What a quick turn great, there. Great play. Nice job that time. Gabe Walter, clean field. Gets it over to Bussin. We've talked about Bussin before. He's got a heck of an arm. He's only a sophomore. Well, no Claire, Eau Claire North threatens, but can't score a run. One hit. What a play. No, and three left on. After two and a half, Hudson four, North zero. All right, welcome back to Hudson Field here. A nice way to end a, uh, yeah. a kind of a, a scary, not scary, but kind of. big threat. Yeah, but big threat there. And brings us play. up to the part of that double play right here. Jake Busson leading off, bottom of the third for Hudson. He made that, he and Gabe Walter, along with Owen Wedge, turned that double play to end that inning. Bussin, the number two batter, grounded out to third his first at bat. Curveball that time. Ooh, That's going to get over the over. top of shortstop there. Out into left field for a base hit. No way. Just dropped one over the uh, shortstop. Look at you, single. Number eight, Owen Anderson. All right, the Raging Bulls back up to hit now. That's number eight, our pitcher, Owen Anderson. I think he got rid of the, got rid of the toilet paper. Bowl look. Yep. I like that. I don't know. He's kind of a tough guy, so. He definitely is. Are you kidding me? Oh, hurt ball that time. Fall back. Got a little piece of that one. Own one on Anderson. Again, bottom of three here. Hudson leading 4 0. Big inning that Erickson took one deep. Scored three of them. Can't see at this point. I can see down the line if uh, North decides to throw somebody, at least if they're down in the, the bullpen down on that side, I'll be able to see that. But yeah. right now, nobody warming up. Busson just kind of playing over there. Not mm -hmm. getting a big lead, but he's making Milner at least think about him. How would you like to be his uh, mom or dad and see that uniform Ooh. when he gets home? Yeah. Huh? Wow. He is a mess. Love it. He's been rolling around out there like uh, what do they call that in the SEAL teams? Make uh, sand sugar cookies. Yeah. yeah. Well, if, if you're going to be sweaty, you may as well be dirty too, right? Yeah. That's, that's awesome. <laughs> Just teasing him down at first. Ground oh, ball hit. to the shortstop. Ooh. Tough hop there, but he was able to turn it to second. In time to double turn the play. double play, Anderson hustling down the line, just kind of trips over the base. Again, good defense there by the middle infield of both teams. No gimme on the double there. Nice work there by North. It's two outs. 
own wedge up to the plate. Singled his last at bat, scored a run. Two outs, bottom three here. Curveball that time. Just Gets just a piece of it. Got a little, little piece of that. Two outs. Another curveball that time. Yeah, Fly ball. Oh, kind of trips on it, and he's not going to be able to come in and make the play. He, he took a couple steps back. Out there. All of a sudden, thought that ball was going deeper than it was and lost his footing. This is where it all started last inning, too, Ken. Mm -hmm. So, some more deal. Two outs. Brings up Logan Von Berg, the DH, batting number four batting in the fifth spot tonight. And Norse, left fielder. He has had some action tonight. Mm -hmm. Fire one back over to first. Just keep it real over there, he says. Keeping it real. How's your phone doing? That thing uh, okay? Battery going to explode? Yeah, no, I think I'm good. I'll lose some fingers here. Ball inside that time to Von Berg. <laughs> the boys on the bench chirping over there. I like that one. Wedge of there, he's going to go. Ooh, strike. Ball Swing and a miss. Ball thrown down, and that one's going to drop oh, it into my. left. The Here center we go. field the wedge aggressively pops up and goes Woo! in head first. Away, Third wedge. base that time. Owen Wedge with some deceiving speed oh, out there. Wow. I never would have guessed that, but <laughs> he picks up the two-bagger. Wow. Ends up, uh, gets a good jump on that steal. Ball bounces short of second base, goes into center field. Wedge popped right up, gets to third. So all of a sudden, Hudson got themselves a runner scoring position here. Two outs, one and one on Von Berg. Ball in play, scores another. A great hustle out there. Again, inside corner. He likes those curveballs anywhere mm -hmm. around waist high. They can be just outside or inside the plate, but he's going to call them. That's a tough pitch to hit right there. One and two. Oh, boy, that was a nice-looking curveball there. Yeah, that one, that one looked better than the last one. So... My my phone's buzzing here. My yeah. daughter's umping sop all over at these quad fields oh, behind is that us. Right? Nice. And she's asking for water. And of course, my wife says, "Aaron, I don't have any money." So, curveball that time just outside brings the count full. I feel like Daddy Warbucks around my house. Do you? It's like yeah, I just kind of walk, hand, stand at the door, hand out twenties. Like a human ATM, man. Yeah. Just boom. What do you need? Twenties, yeah, hundreds. What do you got? I'm gonna change the pin number here pretty soon. Right. That's funny. Oh, oh, got him with that curveball. Nasty pitch there. Got him swinging, so uh, that'll end it for that one. Well, for Hudson, a couple of hits. Yeah. Bussin and Wedge, but a double play, and uh, strikeout ends that inning. After three, Hudson four, Eau Claire North zero. All right, here we go. Top of four, Hudson leading 4-0, and Anderson still on the mound for the Raiders. Brings us up to the number four batter, Cole Bacham. Playing left field today for the Huskies. Curveball that time. Strike from Owen Anderson. Owen one. Looks like they're starting to get some bullpen action down here for North. Let's try to get you some numbers. See who uh, who we're looking at. Look like uh, Cody Dayton. Maybe number eight's going down that way. Curveball again for Anderson. Paints that outside corner for strike two. Hey, I'll be right back. One and two. Right Quick pitch that time. Fastball. Fly ball right left, right field. Sorry, right down in that bullpen. Erickson stretches out. Can't quite make the play. A lot of commotion down there with uh, the Eau Claire coaches and players down there. But Erickson got his wheels on. Just about made that play. 
count stays one and two. Anderson being another effective night, being very uh, aggressive with these north batters. Curveball that time, strikeout, nice pitch. Just the third strikeout for Owen. As I said, he's been in control all night. Last uh, inning, North threatened a couple walks and a hit, but double play ended that threat. Brings up first baseman Sam Feck, the number six batter. Five batter, I'm sorry. Curveball just outside. So I think uh, Ken mentioned it before, but we've got just the one camera tonight. Too hot for that uh, backstop camera. So ground ball off the plate. Ducharme hustles down, makes the throw just to the right. Owen Wedge isn't able to scoop that one up. Chad Crone, the batter right now for North. Second baseman. One out. Ooh, curveball that time. Gets away from Owen. Nothing hurt. One and oh. So Feck on first here. Again, one out. Decent lead here. See what Owen. And catcher Kyler Hover going to do with that runner. Who stays put right off of uh, the arm that time. Hit him right in the hand. Ouch. Well, you were saying... Hit you're, by pitch. You're the ATM of your house. Yeah, did you get tapped too? Uh, no, I ran into your wife and oh. I gave her 20 bucks. 20 bucks? Oh, well, she needs some money, so I said, here you go. <laughs> wow, you can move in any time, buddy. I was trying to help you out, brother. <laughs> like, ah, don't go up there and bother him. Here's 20. Whatever, what, Get whatever you need. Jeez. Appreciate it. I got you well, covered. I'm going to hang around with you more often, I, I think. All right. All right, so North threatening here. Fastball oh. that time, just outside. outside. Only one hit for we'll North. A few walks kind of spread out here and there. Owen again in control. Needs a little help out there though. Looks like that second base isn't getting covered. Curveball that time. That's going to go opposite field. See if Eau Claire's going to score the runner. They're going to hold him up hold there. Him. Again, probably a good call. Erickson's mm -hmm. got a nice arm there. Hits the cutoff, but base is juiced again. Living dangerously out there, this Hudson squad. One out. Get number thirteen up. Was it? Uh, was he up last time? Yes. Yep. He was. He was. Yep. Yeah. Jack Klein. He uh, grounded out to second base. His last at bat here. Fastball that time. Inside for a strike. Oh, we've got a new camera person. Oh, yeah, you my, made the swap. My lovely bride, Shannon Conan, has taken over. Strike Break. two. Taking over out there. Again, thank you for her coming out. <laughs> uh, she does like this heat. Does so, she? Yeah, she So does. that's a plus. She honestly does like the heat. Like, like hotter, the better. Fly ball, left field. Boning underneath it. See what Hudson wants to do here. They're going to send that runner on the tag. It's going to get cut. Yeah. Score one. So North gets one in here. Two Just, outs. Oh, oh, back to. Well, there you go. He uh, he sees nobody at third. And he just heads off. Well, I had my head down it. marking the book, so I I didn't see what happened. If we did, we vacate. Okay, we vacated yep. the base, so he advanced. All right. Yeah, you got to be heads up against those good teams. Mm -hmm. They're going to be aggressive on the base paths. So sack fly that time for Jack Klein. Scores a run. Runner at second advances to third. So two outs, runners at first and second. Brings us up to number 14, Roscoe Rennick. Singled his last at bat.
Ooh. Right down the pipe that time for strike one. The heat. Nice pitch. It's funny when it gets hot out here, you don't have to use the bathroom. You just keep <laughs> drinking water. Keep drinking. And, yep, just stay hydrated. Runners going. See what they want to do. They're going to throw down, try to get him there. Delayed steal that time. Oh, nice play. <laughs> Woo! What a play. I'll tell you, our catcher, catcher holding strong there. Yep, and just a great job that time, holding his position. Wow. Crone, the runner, I think. He's just shaking up there. He flew right into Hope's foot, and just uh, our catcher didn't budge at all. Nice play. So that was a cut play. Second baseman Gabe Walter came over, made that cut, made the throw back to home to get that runner. Nice play by both Hove and uh, Walter on that. Well, North scores one. One hit. A couple left on. One left on. I'm sorry with that play at the plate. After three and a half, Hudson four, Eau Claire North one. Wow, we're seeing some great defense tonight, Ken. Again, Kyler Hove, a couple of spectacular plays. Great play to end that inning on that uh, attempt by Eau Claire North to steal a run. Midby falls that one off to the right. Of course, a couple double plays. Both teams have had it. I think Hudson's had two and North said one. So. Right, yep. Yeah, some great D by both squads out there. Hudson really <laughs> with some clutch D, right? Absolutely. I mean, I bases mean, loaded bases, twice. And yep, yep. Two big defensive plays got him out of both those innings. So. Your phones are ringing, ding, ding, ding. Is it? I'm yeah. a dinging. You're She's probably table. She, that's probably my wife. Twenty bucks wasn't enough from Conan. I need yeah. more, right? Yeah. Was, no, so now my daughter's saying you can sit, bring the water whenever. So I think my wife took your twenty bucks and said, "The heck with it," just pocketed it. <laughs> by heading down Throwing to Barker's or something stop. for some wings. Nice throw that time. Good throw beats the runner. <laughs> your wife's out like, "Well, that was nice, son." <laughs> <Yeah. laughs> <laughs> um, I, I told you know, you know my wife. She's got dark hair. Yeah. Okay. Well, I hope it was your wife. I don't know. She said, "Is there an upstairs?" I said, "Here you go." But it I'm probably teasing. wasn't your wife. I'm teasing. Brings us up to the catcher, Kyler Hove. Singled funny. and knocked it a run. Scored a run last inning. I'm sorry, in the second. Nice curveball that mm -hmm. time for a strike. And good looking pitch. Miller not really uh, getting too high up in his pitch count. We'll see where they want to go with it. They did have a couple arms warming up down in the bullpen. They did, okay. Mm -hmm. How high is he? Do you have a count going? He's got 57. Ooh, that looked like it might have hit him. Uh, oh, 57 thank you. on the thank you. pitch count. One and one. One out. Sun's starting to sneak down on us just a little bit. Fastball that time for strike two. One and two here, one out. Hudson up four to one, bottom of four. Fall back that time by Kyler. So what would you call this? This isn't a dry heat. And it's not super humid. It's just kind of in between her. Stinking it's, hot it's is what it is. Yeah, it's just hot. And it's been what? Nineties for about four days now in a row, and I think we're gonna get it <laughs> up through crazy. the weekend. Yeah. Strike three that time. I don't remember a stretch like this in a while. You know what I mean? From well, without rain, typically you yeah. get a big rainstorm that blows through, That's and right. That's right. big storms that. But there hasn't been a, hardly a cloud in the sky. Oh. Up north, I see a bunch of them coming through on the nightly news, where it's like, oh yeah, Brainerd got hit and Hayward and. Nothing here to break things up. It's, it reminds me a little bit of uh, that Florida heat, you know? Yeah. Get this. I did uh, my um, my boot camp for the Navy. Yeah. August 13th, I went. Where were you? Uh, in Orlando, Florida. Ooh. It turns out it's really, really humid and hot. Yeah. So not just not just hot. It's really humid. Mm. 
and they parade you around in jeans that they call dungarees. Yeah. And uh, a dark blue shirt. Raiden Ducharme, the batter here. Ground ball, the second base, over to one to retire the side. Four, Hudson in the bottom of the fourth. No runs, no hits, nobody left. After four, Hudson for Eau Claire North, one. I might just stick around here and see if uh, we can get the double-A team on, uh, on the field yeah. on camera, maybe. You mind if I take off these sweaty uh, things on my ears for go, go a few for minutes? It. Okay. Go for it. All right. 12 double A team for Hudson out there on the field. That's off to those guys. We'll be right back. All right. All right top back. top of the you're back now, homie. Okay. Okay. Top of the so, fifth. Roscoe yep. up to bat. Roscoe, he's uh, leading off. He was at the plate when that double play happened in the top of four. So what are we at here now, Ken? Four to one? Top of, yep. top of five? Top of five, yep. You're running around out there. You're I know. You I know. Okay? I'm good. I'm right. good. Bunt squares the bunt that time. Falled off. Interesting play. Owen Anderson getting a little help from his defense the last couple innings to uh, close things out. But, again, in control. Only two hits given up by Owen. This, uh, Three young strikeouts. This young man's first name is one of my favorite uh, all-time names. Roscoe? Mm -hmm. Yeah, you, you know, Dukes Remember? of Hazard guy? Mm -hmm. I used to love the Dukes. Yeah. Right? Oh, nice curveball that time. They're pretty fun to watch, those uh, good old boys taking with, jumps with that Roscoe. car. Oh, what did he used to say? Go, yeah. Yeah. <laughs> with Flash the dog, right? Mm -hmm. Flash. Mm, funny show. Friday nights. Ooh, quick there pitch that go. time by Anderson. Almost catches the runner off, but was, he falls it off. Was that a Friday nighter? That was Friday night. I think you're right yeah. about that. You got a memory like a steel trap on Oh, yeah. And Ouch. then uh, what was after that? Dallas? Mm -hmm. Was that Friday nights? I think so. All yeah. right. Kenton says, yep. <laughs> then then, then, <laughs> the, sa then the Saturday night was uh, Love Boat and Fantasy Island. Ooh, wow. just missed on that curveball. You got the lineup down. But of course, like you know, that. I uh, I couldn't stay up that late, but I, I caught the six o'clock hee haw every week. Oh, there's <laughs> a classic. <laughs> and you guys in Spooner must have loved that hee haw. Oh, yeah. Well, we had country and western up there. You bet. Ooh, Line nice drive that time into left center field. You're holding it one. Roscoe yep. with a couple hits tonight. Yeah, Roscoe's Hitting got pretty the well. On the ball, he's doing just fine. player there. Number 15, Jonah Hansen. up now, Jonah Hansen. Like I said, they've been, they've threatened a couple of times. Owen's been able to get out of it. Mm -hmm. Again, we're four to one here, top of five. Winner's going to for sure uh, get a share of the Big Rivers Conference Championship. Big, big year for Hudson Baseball. I think I mentioned earlier in the season, last winning season they had was 2012, and I don't know. I'll have to go back and look before we uh, cover a playoff game when the last time they were in the running for a conference championship. It's yeah. been a while. Well, I don't want to alarm you, but we do have a VIP in the booth. Johnny Roulette has made his way up. Oh, to boy, the, uh, I to thought I booth. smelled something. Yep. You're smelling the winnings of Johnny. <laughs> He's cash money. 2-0. and 2-0, and no outs. Man on first still. If All you were expecting time. it to be any cooler up here, John, you, you're <laughs> sadly mistaken. <laughs> oh, that a boy. <laughs> you know, Rennick over there, I remember last at bat, he was kind of Ooh. getting that long secondary lead, too. So let's keep yeah. an eye on Kyler Hove. Got a little bit of obstruction in his line there with the left-handed batter, but... Oh, he's got a good arm down to first. Count goes to 3-0. and oh. Bobo Nobody out. checking in, saying the boys are looking good. He's pitched that uh -huh. time by Owen Anderson. I thought the last the last two looked really good. Maybe just a little high. What, well, I, what I've noticed, yeah. yeah, anything kind of waist waist high, he really likes that, even yeah. a little off the plate. Huh. It's kind of his zone there. That's the deal, right? You got to kind of <laughs> there's a zone, but you got to figure out what the ump's looking for. Absolutely. Once you dial that, you, you work through that. Yeah, and if they're consistent for both teams right. and consistent right. throughout the game, it's 
it's it's fair. It yep. usually ends up being just fine that way. You do see on occasion that hey, all of a sudden a strike zone changes, and as a pitcher, that's pretty darn frustrating. Yeah, yeah. But three and one, no outs. Fly ball that time out to right field. Erickson looks like he's got underneath a beat on it. Makes the catch for the first out. The move about 50 yards on that one. Nice catch, though. One down. In the number two spot, number six, Evan Zachow. Zachow up for north this time. And one out. Pitch count at 81 right now. I love that you told me where the pitch count's at. Now I feel like I know a little, little extra nugget out there. Owen's tucking the shirt in at the mound. He's probably sweating a little bit, too. He's probably thinking, Ooh. getting a little chafed. Oh, I can't imagine. I did find something for chafing. I don't know if you want to talk about it on the air or not, but uh, <laughs> I don't need if you're ever <laughs> looking for something, I got something. All right. The runner was like, here's what you'd use. I'm like, oh. Text the booth, Ken Conan. Yeah. Chafing. Topic chafing. I know. I've got a product for you. <laughs> I wish they were. I wish I could get them as a sponsor because they're. The name is really something else. It's eluding me right now, but it's a heck of a product. Well, there is a product out there called Monkey Butt. Oh, that's for it. real. Okay, you knew it. <laughs> Gosh. <laughs> yes. Nice stop that time by Hove. That is exactly why you're my go-to in the booth. Okay. You are just. You're right on it every time. You got memory like a steel <laughs> trap. Monkey Butt. Yep. Yeah, so when, yeah. I'm, when I'm out running marathons, yeah, a little bit of that do. stuff goes yeah. a long ways, man. I don't know. Maybe I'll talk to Owen about it after the game. <laughs> <laughs> you wait. Next game, he's going to be like, that was the best. Woo! Nice pitch. Nice curveball that time. I, I Kyler Hove's licking his chops here. Mm-hmm. Rennick's getting a big secondary mm-hmm. lead. You can even see the dust kind of moving as far out as he's getting there. Just see what both Owen and uh, Kyler want to do here to keep that runner at bay. Not a lot to gain there other than just kind of keeping control of the base runners. Fall back. Oh, that's a Going up one and two. Raiders streaming mobile, hopefully a little bit north of it, or south of it, or east. I feel like the deliriousness might be starting to set in on me. <laughs> <laughs> I'm starting to get a little squirrely. One and two, one out. Hold it together, Ken. Here we go. You got your brain on monkey butt here. Yeah, I know. That was... I tell you, that stuff is money, though. Owen doing a good job. Just kind of controlling the tempo of the game here. Gates takes a peek over to one. Ooh, boy, nice Ooh, curveball that curve. time. Catches that ben is just at the right time. Catches one. that inside corner. What a pitch. Strikeout number four for Owen Anderson. Two outs. Brings us up to number 30, Gabe Richardson, the number three batter. Big guy. Everything north has been throwing it on. He's been able to keep it under control and in command. Ooh, curveball that time gets away. He wasn't going to wear that one. That was about head high. Yep. That would ring your bell just a little bit. One, one and oh. Looking at those, a lot of these Hudson guys out there, even Owen's got some sleeves on. He's got to be getting hot. That's a dark color he's wearing. I'm sure he's lathered up getting a little sweat going but yeah it is warm well and thank goodness for some of the new technology some of those shirts they make nowadays they really do make a heck of a difference oh, yeah. the ones that can wick and kind of provide a little bit of breathing mm-hmm. I remember being out there with a cotton shirt just there dying. it is right there, there. he got him oh my oh, boy that was a good throw right at the right spot on the bag mm. wedge gets the tag down Rennick just beats it back I thought we were going to get one there. Nice throw that time by Hove. Now that runner, we'll see if he wants to stay as aggressive. Yeah, right. Curveball that time. Woo! Oh, one just getting nice. that thing to drop perfectly. Nice. Not much a batter can do on that other than stay in and mm-hmm. try to make contact. A lot of times, especially now with that curveball falling it off, just stay alive. Wait till you get a pitch you like. Two and two. Two outs. Runner going. going. Fall back. Oh, still two and two. 
two outs. Now remind me, Aaron, on the pitch count. Is it a hundred? Yeah, and, and it, it kind of depends on, you can go over that a little bit if you started the inning below it. That's what happened with the one the oh, last, the last game. game. Yeah, yeah, he was, oh boy, look at that. Boom. Just a great inside corner curveball. Hove sets him up perfect that time for strikeout number five. Four north, no runs on a hit, one left. After four and a half, Hudson four, north one. All right, welcome back to Hudson Field. It's the bottom of the fifth here. My name's Ken Conan. We've got Aaron Sundin with me. On the camera today is, this afternoon, is Shannon Conan doing a great job down there. Appreciate her pinch hit. And Brian Mose had to duck out for a little bit of soccer. River Channel's doing a... All sorts of broadcasts in town. They've got soccer going on tonight, too. So he ducked out for that. We are at a fun boys uh, baseball game oh, here. Hudson Soccer is uh, another team to be reckoned with. We've been talking about all the uh, good sports this year for Hudson, but yeah. Hudson Girls Soccer Team has been excellent. Uh, talked to, well, actually it was Mike Miller from the Rhinos. Oh, yeah. And... Um, he had said that they have a good team this year, but Hudson's beat them twice and actually beat them pretty handily. So, huh, interesting. Yeah. Yeah, I'll, I'll tell you, Aaron, it's been one of those years for Hudson sports where we've had a lot of great, I mean, mm -hmm. just a lot of teams are doing really well right now. Yeah. It's fun to see. Very fun. Mr. Erickson up to the plate, one for one with that big three-run <laughs> home run back in the second inning. Kind of a big play nice there. Nice return to the field and that's going to be a base hit in the five six hole look at this guy go love it I get a single oh, Erickson, he is a, a hot hand and again a threat to run he's got some speed we'll see how aggressive mm -hmm. coach Blagan wants to be here up four to one bottom of five but you know again you've got a pitcher up there with Milner who's lefty but Throws a lot of curveballs, not a whole lot of speed. We've had a couple throws, throwdowns to second already where Hudson has stolen bases, so I think it's a fairly good chance here that we're going to see that runner take off. Not a big lead right now. Toss it back to first. Keep him honest over there. Gabe Walter up to the plate, leading off, or the leadoff batter, number two in this inning. Flied out to center field his last at bat. Erickson, not a huge lead, oh, and they're going to oh try to boy. get him here. we got a pickle. We like those. Those are a lot of fun. Goes back to first. Erickson's got some speed. Let's see how long he can keep this thing going. Aggressively, you can <laughs> see how everybody kind of gets in there. There's nobody else. Okay, right field's coming in. Erickson going to hit the deck. God, oh, got under. Eat the tag. Woo, what a play. Erickson, all-star, and they'll help him up to his feet after that one. Wow. Yeah, he had every intention to go, and just a nice pick move by Milner. Erickson kept it going. You could see the body scrambling to get into position. We had right field coming in to cover first base on that last little cycle, but wow. I tell you, that was that, awesome. that's that that is what makes baseball fun. Is uh -huh. when those pickles are hot box, whatever you want to call them. Those are uh, excellent. I can remember. I'll we'll talk about it here in a second. Walter here, 0 and 0. Got a piece of falls that one. him back. So I, I, I don't remember what age group it was, but it was pretty young. Yeah. And uh, coaching. And we would work on that hot box drill and pickle drill, and the kids loved it. Yeah. Well, it didn't take time for all nine players out on the field to try to get into the whole mix of it. <laughs> and, you know, you'd have your left, if it's, if it's like that last play between first and second, you got your left fielder booking over there to try to get in the action. It's right. like, no, no, no. We'll let you do the drill, but you can't do that in a game. Right. Bases are all Everything's vacated. Empty, right? Yeah, just, there we go. Erickson, decent lead again. Mm. Strike two on Gabe. Well, was uh, rolling away on that one. Yeah, got him with the curveball. Mm -hmm. One and two is the count. No outs. Erickson out at second after a fun... I don't know how many of those. Uh, um, there was probably four, maybe five right? little switchbacks there. <laughs> With something else. 
Lays off that high fastball. Two I, only, two. I think I can count on one or two fingers how many pickles I've seen folks get out of. Right? <laughs> yeah. It's not many. No. Usually you're done. Yep. And that last throw just a little high. Erickson dove in head first and got under the tag. Full commit. Curveball fouled off that time by Gabe. Staying alive in there. We're at watching these uh, water bottles. You know, you gave me this cold one. It's got a little condensation yeah. on it, and I, and I feel like I'm, I got, I'm pushed. i got to finish this thing Can before it thing. gets hot on me, so yep. it's boiling. Can that one get to the cool one. There he goes again. Curveball oh, outside. In there, no problem. Just eating the bases up. Yes, two stolen bases that time, or two stolen bases on the uh, inning here for Erickson. Puts him in scoring position at third base. Full count to Gabe Walter. Boy, Erickson having a heck of a game. All right, so now at third base on that steal. 3 2, full count, no outs. Inside, Inside. good bat that time by Gabe. Walter with a nice, nice at bat there. Battling through some pitches. Got that last ball, he's off to first base, so I'll put him out on the corners now. First and third. Walter on first, and third is. Here, you got any Jeopardy music? You got some Jeopardy music you can play with the oh coach gosh. going to the uh, mound? Uh, Jeopardy music. How about this? Our dude. You're killing me, Smalls. <laughs> That's what you get. Uh, I don't have Jeopardy. Got this one. Baba Bowie. Baba Bowie. <laughs> Baba Bowie. <laughs> Wasn't that uh, That's from Howard, Howard Stern? Yeah, Howard yeah. Stern. Baba Bowie on Howard Stern, yep. Well, we'll just get a little organ going. Go. And just a little rally music. Just in the mood here, right? Ba -ba -ba -ba. Ba -ba -ba -ba. So, again, you got your most aggressive base runner on third base here with a 4-1 to lead. I would expect Coach Blagan got the speedster Gabe Walter. Is Dad still here? No, he left. He couldn't handle the heat up here. He couldn't take the hot box up here. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> so... Again, one out. You take a chance here. Send that runner. See yeah. what, how clear o Eau Claire North reacts. They may just give up the base. Yeah. And not uh, yeah. not worry about Gabe Walter and let uh, Erickson stay at third. We'll see. That's probably what they were talking about a little bit. Busting up to the plate. Catcher puts the call out. Infield is in. They're trying to protect that run. It's an exciting ball here. Got him on the corners. Bu -bu 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 -bus in. Time to bust one out. Ball in the dirt. Mm -hmm. Ball one. Coach Blagan giving the sign. Blagan sure is a nice guy. Super fun, good guy. Fun Happy to, to have to. him yeah. for a coach. Yeah, he's just like great. I said, baseball program starting to turn around. It's nice to see. Walter's going. The pitch inside, they're not going to throw down. Didn't think they would. Yeah, I thought maybe it. they'd go down to third base if they were peaking and Erickson had a big lead. But All right, two on the pond here, nobody out. Bottom of the fifth, Bussin with a one-and-one one count. Singled his last at bat. In, infield, just they're in on the grass right now. Good ball that time inside. Yeah, they're they're in again trying to protect from Erickson scoring and you can see how far off the base Gabe Walters getting. Right. He'll probably get beyond the shortstop here on that secondary lead. Nobody covering. Nope. Curveball. Liked it. Might not be deep enough here. Shortstop's dropping back. Makes the catch for the oh. first out. Yeah, the short drop back to the uh outfield grass there, made that catch. So one out. Raging bow up. Oh, and Anderson. Yeah, got a chance to help his cause here. Oh, and talking to the uh, talking to the catcher a little bit. A little smirk there. I'll step out of the batter's box and get set. And one out there. Bottom of the fifth. The pitcher looks over his shoulder. Nobody anywhere near the, uh, <laughs> <No>. <laughs> the bag. 
Ooh, gets him with a curveball. Swinging for the fences that time. Yes, he was. Well, a good hit ball could score two. Oh, absolutely. Right? Yeah, especially with the lead Walter's getting. And mm -hmm. He knows there's nobody there to cover, so he's going to keep Let's getting get... off that base, mm -hmm. getting a decent, uh, decent start on anything off the crack of the bat. High that time. One and one. Four and one. Get set up. Kind of taking his time in the box. I like that. Ooh, Ooh we cut like that, that one. one. Yep, another strike. Good pitch. Thinking about it here, taking his time, knows that if, if he can put it into play, that probably scores a run. Especially right side, that's going to definitely score Erickson with the, his speed. One and two. One out. Miller steps off. Everybody kind of regrouping. They know, both teams know this is big right now. <clears throat> One and two. <laughs> Short stop playing back there. Curveball. Oh, oh, gets a piece oh, of it, boy. just falls that one back. Had to protect the plate. Yep. Might have been a little outside, but again, good good time to take that one opposite field. And with the infield playing in, it's not going to take much to get over the top and, like you said, probably score two. All right, now, if he's battling here, coach down there, down the third base line. Give him a good clap and. No, keep that on. One and two, one out. That one, right Popped field, up, right that's going to be deep enough to advance Erickson. They're going to look to try to make that oh, cut. Here comes here Erickson. Comes. Full There's speed. not going to be a play. He's going to get in there. Woo! Standing out. Nice job. Lots of speed there at three. Then... Walter also advances on that sack fly by Owen Anderson in the RBI. Great play there by Owen Anderson, taking it off the field. Great play. Another insurance run there for mm -hmm. Hudson. Five to one. Two outs. Wedge up. Wedge not afraid to get that uni dirty. He is. Got both legs dirty now. He's, he's a mess. Yeah. In the best way possible. He's been doing some great base running out there. Mm -hmm. Gabe Walter at three. Yep. Two outs. Chance for Hudson to put one more on the board here if Wedge can connect. A little high. Just a little. You're we right. have a pretty good vantage point, but it, you can start to kind of see what they're going to call and what uh -huh. they are once once the game kind of gets going. Yeah, you uh, have a great point on his uh, strike zone. Ooh, that one's oh, in the dirt. Oh, oh, bounces we away. Go. We're going to have we a go. play at the plate. Not in time. Boom. Walter with some speed gets some hop off third base and comes in standing up for another run for Hudson. Great heads up play by Walter to hustle on in, make that, uh, get that run in. Very critical, these uh, situations. You get one wild pitch the catcher can't control, and all of a sudden, whoop, goes the weasel. We get another one in. Two balls, no strikes, two outs. And they'll clear the runners off the bags on that one. That was big. Mm-hmm. Three and zero on a one. Gets a strike in there that time. Good pitch there. Three and one. Nice Brown rip. Out of the shortstop. He's playing pretty deep. He is. 
Not in time, I don't think. Nope, they got him. Boy, that was a close play. Owen Wedge with some speed to get down there. It's not a lot of urgency from the shortstop playing so deep, but he's able to make that throw. Hudson, though, gets a couple of runs on one hit. The sack fly by Owen Anderson. And after five, Hudson six. Eau Claire North one. All right, we're back. Hudson leading six to one, top of the sixth inning. Again, big game for both teams. Winner comes out of this with at least a share of the conference championship and certainly with a leg up when it comes to the seeding meeting tomorrow. Owen Anderson on the mound for Hudson. He's at 91 pitches here, so we'll get at least probably one inning out of Hudson or out of Owen. Leadoff batter here. Drops one into right field for a base hit. Cole Bacham was the batter that time, the number four batter. Brings us up to first baseman Sam Feck. Feck up to the plate here for the Huskies. I'm going to get a workman's comp claim for my camera person, I think. Oh, yeah? I think... Uh, I think you take her out to a nice dinner tonight. Yeah, we're going to have to do that, I think. Get in the AC, cool off. Yep. yep celebrate like... the, well, I'm not going to jinx it. Fly ball that time off to the left side. Let's wait until the game gets over. How's that? Yep, she's telling me this this stance isn't going to work. <laughs> <laughs> I offered some other stuff, and you know the heat. It's just, it ain't going to work. Well, so I said, this well, is... the game might be close to over. Yeah. Knock on wood. So yeah. you never know. Well, but look for a workman's comp issue. Um, we'll, I'll put a note out on the company site okay. uh, about what's going on. All right. <laughs> Owen getting up there in the pitch count. I don't know if you talked about that I yet. I did, yep, okay. yep. Yep. So I figured we'd probably see him for um, at least this inning. Now, again, nobody warming up in the Hudson bullpen either, but it does not take long to warm up when it when the heat's like this, this, honestly. Hot, yeah. Oh, my yeah, goodness. Yeah, Especially if you're already in the game. My guess is they'll probably go to Wedge or they could, I suppose, throw Von Berg. He's rested. He's hitting tonight, but not out in the field. So that might be the direction they decide to go. But, again, you got one more game on Thursday. You want to win them both. Get a sweep, and there's no question who the conference champ is. Great pitch that time oh, by Owen. Beauty. Curveball drops it in there for the first out of the inning. Six strikeouts on the night for Owen. That's awesome. Brings up the second baseman, Chad Crone. Inside. Didn't miss by much there. That's going to be fun next year for uh, Owen playing at St. Cloud State. I think yeah. I mentioned before, good program there, good coach. He's a competitor. He'll sit in, he'll settle in well with that team, I think. And it's a good conference. There's some good teams. <laughs> yeah. Mankato State's always solid. Winona State's got a good team. Even even some of the smaller schools in that conference are pretty decent in baseball, so. Again, Hudson up 6-1. Not so concerned about that runner at first. Strike that time inside. Oh, ho, 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 ho. that looked pretty good. Did you get an eye on that one? I did, yeah. Looked like he got in there. I thought that one uh, Kyler threw in down a couple innings ago. That was a close one. I that thought he might have got him. That one, yeah. Get anything left in the cooler up? I got a Two and one. In here. Oh, boy. You are staying hydrated, buddy. Ooh, nice fastball that time. Nice. Tip fouled off. Yep, I packed, uh, packed about as much as I could in this little cooler. Smart. Yep, the heat and not drinking it doesn't do a guy any good. <clears throat> Two and two. Curveball that time. Get some swing and strikeout number seven for Owen Anderson. Two down. Co 
Phelps coming out. Looks like uh, Carter. Well, I think they're going to make a switch here. Carter Herring will go to one. Yeah. He's got his first baseman's glove. That means Owen Wedge is coming into pitch. All right. Great nice job. Nice job, Owen. Okay, ice cube pop out of his hat. <laughs> <laughs> oh, that a boy. There's something about putting some ice around your neck or on your head that just it helps it just right to your core, you know? Well, so Owen's going to come out of the game here. Ducharme will stay in at third. A lot of times you'll see Owen go to third base in that situation, but they might make that switch. Owen's in the lineup for hitting, so they'll have to do some shuffling around. If Carter might go into his batting position, see what the substitution is. Now he got a lefty coming in here, and Owen's pitched really well this year. So... Again, he's got two outs. He's got a 6-1 lead, runner on first base. Just get out of this inning and go hit again one more time, and let's close this game out. Wedge has got kind of that high delivery over the top. Mm -hmm. I like that. Well, we'll Ooh. get him warmed up. We'll, uh, we'll probably we'll say a couple more two. pitches. Okay. Yeah, yep. he'll he'll be he'll be ready we'll, to rock. We'll stick around here. I'm just gonna break, but color good. Probably gonna have to go adjust that camera after this inning. So okay. Just so no, you no know, worries. you're gonna be. We gotta. Just give we're it, we're like, getting close to yeah. the end here. Again, Hudson six runs on six hits, but making the best of their opportunities mm -hmm. and the defense has played very well. Oakland North has four hits. They've had the bases loaded twice, only to end the inning on a couple big plays. One at the plate on a double steal, and then a double play also to end another threat. So Hudson in good control here. Brings us up to number 12 for Eau Claire, Henry Wilkinson. Yeah, I would definitely echo what you're saying. It's fun to see the bats going and the defense rocking. Nice pitch that time. Looked like a changeup from yeah. Owen. Didn't see much movement on the <laughs> on the curveball, but he can throw the curve. He's got a fastball. Mixing things up. Yeah. Another one there. I'm looking on the outside there. They're swinging, I should say, on the outside. Way ahead here, Owen, two. Mm -hmm. Two outs. Not worried about that runner. Ground ball down to third base. Ducharme takes a bad hop. That's going to go into left field. Runner advances to second, but no further. Bounding over there to pick it up. That's a goofy bounce there as he tried to pick it Sometimes, right you know, when, when you're playing in those positions, those balls can eat you up. In other words, all of a sudden, you're kind of expecting it to do one thing and yeah. takes a bad hop or... You know, your feet aren't set, whatever it might be. Hits a rock. Hits a rock, yeah. Well, there's rocks out there, too. That one's going to get through the 5-6 hole. See what they want to do here. They're going to hold that runner. Again, down five runs. I'm sure the coach is thinking, not sure we want to take a chance on that with a play at the plate to end that inning. Mm -hmm. Brings up Roscoe Rennick, two for two on the night. This guy's a hitter. Tonight he looks like a hitter. Yeah. See if Owen can get out of this one here. Curveball nice. that time. Across the plate for a strike. Great pitch. Fouled off the right side. Again, Owen Wedge getting way up in the count. Owen two, I like it. Get one, get one down Main Street here. <laughs> we'll see where they want to pitch on this one. Maybe keep it outside. Nothing good to hit. Keeps it down in the dirt. Got wow, him. Booyah. Boy, that looked lower to me, but he threw him with the gas right there at the knees. And away. For strike three. Again, Hudson gets out of a big inning. A big threat there with the bases loaded. Eau Claire North had, has had a lot of stranded runners tonight, but again, the pitchers and the defense coming through. 
after five and a half, it's Hudson six, Eau Claire North one. All right, we're back here. Bottom of six, Hudson leading six to one. Logan Von Berg to lead off the bottom of the sixth inning. Logan the DH tonight for Hudson. Again, great game so far for Hudson. Playing some tough D, getting some good pitching, and definitely some timely hitting and base running. First pitch. Leads off with a strike. We got a new pitcher here for North. Looks like it's number six, Evan Zakow. Senior. Curveball that time drops across the plate for strike two. A little encouragement there from head coach Brent Blagan. That one's in the dirt. One and two. One and two on Von Berg to lead off the sixth inning for Hudson. Fastball high. Well, I think I have successfully navigated our workman's comp issue we were going to have, Aaron. Yeah, where are you going tonight for dinner? Well, um, I'm not sure. Probably one of our sponsors, Josie's or something. <laughs> yeah. And then we just moved the camera around a little bit, so. That one again in the dirt. So we're good. Good I think. deal. We'll see. We had steaks last night. You know, Jonesy's does that prime rib on the weekends. I wish, wish you could get that anytime. I know that's not easy to do. Yeah. He does that smoked prime rib. You have yeah. that yet? No. I may have to go. Sounds good. Go take you there sometime. A, a thank you. Maybe up to bat. So trying to check on, speaking of conference stuff here, trying to just get a score on that girls game for Hudson. They're over oh. in Chippewa again, kind of in the same boat, playing for a conference championship. How about you're over there making a TikTok or something? No. Okay. No. Okay, you're, you're doing some work. I like that. Yeah. <laughs> I My only, my TikTok is, I like mint. You like or the orange. Mint. Yeah. Mint TikTok. Oh, okay. TikTok. Oh. Is that what it is? Hmm. See, I'm a little old school, Ken. You need to talk to your son, Kate. He'll get you. I've seen I those. Doubt My daughter will send me some of those of sometimes. It's like they uh, kind of le live their lives. That one gets Outside, away. Yeah. Mom Burke's going to move down to second base. Yeah, my brother likes to look at the TikTok, and he'll send me every once in a while, like, the best one he saw all day. Yeah. Um. Yeah. Do you ever do TikToks? <laughs> well, I do not. You know, I actually, uh, this is sound nerdy, but with Raider streaming, I try to stay on the cutting edge as much yeah. as I can with the with the kids and kind of getting the uh, high school kids' attention so they watch and tune in. And um, So I don't know. Maybe next year we'll do one for football. Do a TikTok? Or this year, I mean, yeah, for TikTok. All right. I don't, I don't know what that's going to look like. But, Me neither. But we'll, we'll, we'll I trust shake you. shake something out, yeah. Two and one on Matt Midby. Outside. Oh, Cut that outside oh, corner. Oh, oh, oh. I don't know. It seems like the stuff I've seen on those TikTok videos. Yeah. People have like bunny ears on and oh. weird faces and stuff like that. Oh. And maybe that's something else. Maybe that's a different Snapchat channel than or something. I've watched. Yeah. Curveball that time. Jams oh, midfield. It's going to be a fly it. ball out to left field. Made the the fielder makes the catch. That'll be uh, out number one. Yeah, I think that might. We're really uh, funny, but I think that might be Snapchat. <laughs> Probably. Okay. Yeah, we're not, I'm not doing that. I um, um, can't figure that out. Brings up Kyler Hold, the catcher. Yep. One out. Von Berg at second. Ooh, oh, nice line nice drive trap. hit right up to center field. Bomb Berg's going to round it they and look. Hold him. They hold him. They're going to hold him up. Hove, two for three Ooh. on the day. He's been playing great. Had that ESPN style catch earlier. Couple hits. Fun to see all the uh, the action with the boys. Both sides, right? Defense and offense, looking really good. Here's your courtesy runner again. It's the courtesy runner. You know, if I'm a if I'm a catcher, I'm sure Kyler probably wants to say, you know, I can run, Coach. Come on. 
right? Give me a chance. Yeah, let me, let me do this. Oh, we got Wiley Balmer at first. He's got some speed. Let's see if they want to get aggressive and send him here. Brings up third baseman, Braden Descharm. One out. Runner's going. He's going to hold it. Nope, they're going to try that cut play. Mm. Again, not really in sequence, but nothing nope. hurt. Nope. Descharm, 2-0. Oh. There's just no breeze out there. You know that No, I see that does. It? Yeah. <laughs> Balmer getting a big lead. Charm with the cut. Swinging for the fences on that one. Just missed. Two and one. Again, swing and a miss. Two and two. I'd like to see him get the bat on the ball here and just drop one into play. Side. Good Count goes there. full. Yep. Good eye. Falls that one back. Up over into the uh, parking lot. Count bad. stays full. One out. Oop. Catcher's getting a little hot there. I think he called for that timeout. Poor guy's got the sun right in his eyes. Mask on. The kid's battling through it today. Ducharme that time out. To left field, left fielder playing pretty shallow. There's not going to be a tag. Mm. Flies out to left field for the second out. Brings up two for two on the day. Sam Erickson. Oh boy. A left fielder was just in the perfect position on that last hit. Mm hmm. And they're going to walk Erickson here. Probably a good move. Oh, that's that's the new way of walking him. You just say you can just should. say it. Yeah. Interesting. That's the lazy way of walking. Yeah, I like the old way where you. <laughs> well, you still got to You still got to pitch to them, yeah, and yeah. sometimes, honestly, I've seen I've seen right. it happen. Right. Get it too close to the plate, ball gets poked out into play. Right. Jam ooh, job ooh. that time on Walter. Wow, he came around, hit in front of the dugout. Own one. Curveball that time. Hop Falled up. off right side. I think that one's going to be in play. Yep, it is. You get him. To retire the side. For Hudson, no runs. One hit, three left on. Coming to the bottom of, I'm sorry, top of seven here. Hudson leading six to one. Welcome back to Raider Field. It's the top of the seventh inning. Mr. Sundin said it's the top of the order. Top so. of the order, yep. Jonah Hansen up to the plate. 0 for 3 so far on the night. Just kind of watching that uh, north huddle after that inning. I think they're kind of tired. They look a little worn down. Not yeah. a lot of juice there, so we'll yeah. see what happens here. A lot can happen with this leadoff batter. If he can reach, might see a little energy picking up. The good start there by Owen Wedge. <laughs> Strike one. It looks like that thing's barely moving. Yeah. Right? It's like, wow. Curveball that time. Gets it again. Oh, oh Wedge. Strike is, two. Wedge has got some some stuff going now. Head in the count. Ground ball, second base. Backhand by Gabe Walter. Makes Ooh. the throw over to Carter nice here job, for Walter. the first out. Great grab by him. Brings up Evan Zacco. 
0 for 2 with a walk in the third inning. Curveball, nice bender that time. Wow, that thing came in a <laughs> foot and a half. <laughs> Good looking pitch. Got away just a little bit, or he's working that outside. One and one. Jammed him up. That's popped up infield. Bussin calls for it. Makes the catch for the second out. All right, down to one out here. Brings up Gabe Richardson, the number three batter, playing third base tonight. Again, Hudson leading six to one. Chance to be at the minimum <laughs> Cole Conference champions here. Oh, Wedge has got some good looking pitches going, doesn't he? He just moves it around nice mm -hmm. and different off speed stuff. Curveball that time, gets him again, strike two. Wow. What I like about it, too, especially like a, as an announcer here, we're watching him. He wants to keep the action moving. He's mm -hmm. quick, gets into his motion, and off to the races. So, 0 2 pitch, curveball. Ooh, yes. Boom. I must have missed one. I thought he was up 0 2, but I my bad. Too, 1 yeah. and 2. I did, too. 1 and 2. Yeah, I was thinking he had a couple strikes on him already. Again, quick motion by Owen. Here he comes to the plate. Ground ball down to third. Ducharme makes the throw to first base, and there it is, folks. Oh, yeah. Big win for the Hudson Raiders. Again, turnaround season for them. Got some experience, but a lot of young guys here. Future's bright for Hudson baseball. Hudson wins this one 6-1 to one for at least a share of the conference championship going into Eau Claire on Thursday. Again, great effort all around. I thought the defense played excellent, had a couple of uh, innings there where North was threatening, and they were able to get out of it. Great job by their leader on the mound, Owen Anderson, and then, of course, the other Owen came in, Owen Wedge, to close it out. Big hits across the board, but probably the biggest one happened in that second inning, that three-run home run by Jack Eric Erickson. Or, I'm sorry, Jack, that's his brother, Sam. Sam Erickson. Sam yeah. Erickson. And, uh, and, again, he singled another at bat and scored in the fifth inning, but... All around, just a great effort, team effort by Hudson. So, great job, and you know what? We're gonna at that least one. be uh, we're gonna be hosting a playoff game for sure. You can see them out there; they're fired up. Coach Blagan's in the middle of the of the huddle out there and out in left field. But what do you think, boss? It's a hot one. Thanks for hanging in there with me. Um, your final six to one. We'll be back Thursday. Thursday, softball. Yep, yep. I nope. don't have a score on that yet. We'll f we'll know on Thursday kind of where they sit. But again, playing for conference and exciting times here for Hudson baseball. Thanks for joining us on RaidersStreaming.com and the River Channel. Ken Conan and Sundin and Shannon Conan on the camera. We'll see you next time.